I want to talk about your laser engraving, but sure. something that I just thought about was, uh, you know, this is going to make it rather difficult, I think, for retail arbitrage people who can't restock products. Mm-hmm. But I also wonder how they're going to work it. Let's say you're one of 10 people selling mm-hmm. on a listing. If you run out of stock, the listing is still in stock. So is that still right. going to count against you? Or are they going to be like, oh, we're good. We got other sellers. You know, how is that going to work exactly as well? Right. Is it based on your stock as a skew or is it based on the ASINs sales and your stock against the ASIN sales in 28 days? Which I would hope it's your individual sales because, you know, there's too many other variables, which seem would seem to make it more punitive. Yeah. Yeah. But even in that case, it doesn't make sense, right? Because their goal of the fee is they want to keep products in stock. But if there's other sellers Correct. on the listing, the product is still in stock. So why would you punish the person for running out of stock if the product is still in stock itself? So yeah, it's going to be weird. And part, part of it, the game truly is just stay in the game because yeah. over time, these we talked about like, you know, there's constant changes in fees and sometimes they, some bean counter looks at it. It was like, Oh, we need to do this fee because we need to reward this. And then they realize, Oh, there's this unintended consequence. So maybe to your point, they start finding like, Hey, we're losing out on sales of low, low movement products, but there's Mm -hmm. enough of them in their catalog that it's now hurting them because sellers maybe don't want to, offer them any and they start finding like it it hurts our ability to be the everything store and so i've seen a lot of the pendulum swings and sometimes all you got to do is when the pendulum's swinging just kind of move your head out of the way so you don't get hit (laughs) yeah and and two you know if if this does end up being where a lot of sellers decide to be done and you're the one who rides it out there's exactly that much more opportunity on the other Mm -hmm. side yeah, and there's there's constantly sellers coming in and out of the game, and you know some of it is just stay in it. Absolutely.